Hey everyone, this is my official um, spoiler for my advent calendar that I sent out. Um, so if you do not want to see this, this is your time to click off this video. If it came up in your next um, roll of videos to watch, um, this is your chance to skip it. Um, I will sell the advents to probably the week before Thanksgiving and then after that I think I'll be pretty much done with selling them. So the pre-order when you're when you're seeing this ended yesterday so um, there will be an order up. I did not sell out of, of my advents with my pre-order so there will be a link that is up. It will have my standard two week to three week processing time. I sell out, it's really selling out of these bags, um, then the advent calendar, then there will be no, no more for sale. So the orders that are out or that are up now are a limited quantity based off of how many bags I have left to make the advents. So um, I'm gonna talk a little bit about the advent before we get in there in case somebody is accidentally on this video. Um, so this is my first ever advent calendar. It's an advent calendar that is just savings challenges. So you're not going to get other budgeting items in it like um, envelopes, binders, uh, dice. I don't know, like, like other budgeting items. You're not going to get any of that in here. These are strictly savings challenges. And the vast majority of them are scratch off. Um, there's a couple games in here that are not scratch off, but everything else... Um, uh, is scratch off besides like minis anyways so it is a 12 day advent calendar uh, I just thought a full 24 day would be um, maybe too much of a price point um, sorry you're gonna hear the puppy in the background he, li he lives here now so <laughs> um, but yeah so this is just the standard uh, 12 day advent calendar and you can do it the first 12 days of Christmas. You could do it the 12 days leading up to Christmas. It is up to you. You can open it when you get it all at once. You can open it in November when you get it. It does not matter. You make the rules. So um, they are all savings challenges. They all are exclusive to this advent calendar. So these are not challenges that I grabbed out of my shop and put in bags randomly. These are ones that are specially um, made for this advent calendar. So they're not anything you're gonna find in my shop. Um, it is a winter themed slash Christmas themed advent. There's not much Christmas in there. Um, maybe like a quarter of it is Christmas. And then the rest is like a gen generic winter theme with the idea that you'll be using it in the first quarter of next year. Um, or you could save it and it could be your Christmas challenges for next year. It's up to you. Um, let me think, what else can I say about the advent? Um, I do not know the total that it adds up to saving you. Um, so sorry about that. But each challenge, does have the denominations and the total saved on them. Um, these are the two exclusive freebies that you get with the advent. There's a warm and fuzzy wishes little mini and a peace, joy, and wags, which I thought was so cute mini. Um, if you've ordered from my shop before, you know I always include a mini um, as a freebie along with some stickers. So these are going to be the minis you get. You get both of them if you purchase the advent. So we're getting to the point where I'm gonna start opening this guy up. Um, and yeah, I just wanna give you one last chance to turn away if, this is, if you don't wanna see the spoiler. Um, I will put a link directly to the advent calendar in my description box. So if at this point you decided, you know what, I want to buy it. I don't want to be spoiled on it. Um, you can go ahead and click there and click out of this video. But now we are about to start. These will be all secured with washi tape. I just don't have them for mine. So about these cute little craft bags. I thought they were super cute. So first things first is you get a savings challenge. Um, on the front of each advent bag. So I laminated these because I wanted to attach them with a sticker. You might have to kind of 
scrape that off. But um, these are all a bunch of micro challenges um, for you. There will be 12 of them. So that is also a challenge. All right, so this is day one of the advent. And it is I Run On Coffee and Christmas Cheer. It is a little cute mousse. It's $70, one through 10. Um, I just thought it was really cute. So this is one of the Christmas challenges, but it's also just, you know, a generic winter theme too. Um, so that is day one and everybody's advent is going to be the same layout because I wanted to do that in case people wanted to show it on social media or on their YouTube chan channels. They weren't spoiling it for other people if I like mixed them. Okay, so this is day two. So it's a four by six chickens dressed up for Christmas. I thought they were so cute. Look at him with his antlers and his little deer ears. Um, this is a 61 through nine little chickens. And then with the four by sixes, I've put in some minis. So we get this little dog um, Christmassy one and then the gingerbread drinks minis. Day three. Kind of forgotten how I what order I put these in, so this is exciting for me too. Um, this is like a sweater weather sort of theme, some little Christmassy sweaters, um, and this is 62 through 9, a 5 by 7. Um, okay, this one is gonna be fun. This is a game, so this is Connect 4. I give you a little like Thing in there how to play it so for high income you're gonna roll two dice you're gonna add the numbers together and color in the circle uh, with the total or like exit off whatever you want to do when you connect four you're gonna save a determined amount whatever you decide that is and you can either play until you connect four or play until the board is filled whatever you want to do so how to play at high income is to save each amount you roll and save a different amount for the connect four. Or if you want to do it low income, you could save $1 each roll. And then you, when you connect four, you save that determined amount. So yeah, I just thought that this was a fun um, idea. And yeah, it's a little connect four. It's a little wintry themed game. Um, next is winter wonderland so once again just like a winter themed challenge this is 75 1 through 10 and then here is two minis so the little deer it's, it's ho 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 and you serious clark everybody loves christmas vacation right i do it's my favorite christmas movie all right this one so another five by seven and this is a christmas globe with some polar bears in there and i just saw the northern lights and had to do something with this image because like i live in the midwest and we can see the northern lights at certain times of the year so i just thought that this was so pretty and so like i don't know it just screamed winter to me so um this is a 65 one through nine and Day eight is this cute three set. Um, I love this. It's, they're made to look like quilts, kind of. Um, like a quilted wintry scene. I really like this one. I just really like the darker sky. So this is 61 through seven. This is 65, one through nine. And this is 100, one through 10. So that one's a little bit more expensive. All right, day nine. This is another five by seven and you know it wouldn't be something for me without a boop challenge in there. So a fa la 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 la, boop, 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 boop. <laughs> um, it is 91 through eight. It's a bunch of dogs in some winter hats and scarves. They look so cozy and cute and yeah. We just needed a, a special boop challenge for the advent. All right. This next one is another four by six. And it's like a new year theme. So I already broke my new year's resolutions. 
I thought this was funny. Uh, I am one that over makes New Year's resolutions and I do not stick to all of them, but you know, there is something to be said in the effort of trying. So this is a 71 through 10. And then it also comes with these little minis, tis the season and not made for winter. 100% I am not made for winter. Okay. Oh, I miss, I missed one. I missed four, you guys. We'll come back to it. Okay. 11 is the alphabet game. There's a little way of playing it. So um, the alphabet game is not a new game by any means, but I saw these beautiful like deer letters and decided that I need to do something with it. Um, so high, <clears throat> high income, you can either just randomly choose a letter that you want to do that day or roll a dice and then just kind of like go along the way. And then you save that amount that's listed in the bubble and color it in. What's the matter? Hey, no. Um, or you could do a low income um, version of this. And when you get to these double digits, you could just add the two numbers together if that works better for you. So that is the alphabet challenge. We're gonna go back to four because we missed it. And it is another set of these little woodland creatures. So this is a deer with some mushrooms. It says winter magic. It is 45, one through seven. Then we have this little squirrel. When snow falls, nature listens. It is 65, one through nine. And then the last one, we've got some little birds. It says snuggle weather is here. And it's 81 through eight. All right, I had to give the dog food. All right, can it be quiet? Anyways, this is the finale number 12. And this is a Christmas kit. So you guys know that I have done uh, a labyrinth kit and I like the idea of doing a kit. So um, this comes with an IOU, comes with a couple micros. It also comes with a couple minis, okay comes with like this longer piece um, and this is just a pretty background it says dear Santa with some bells some um, what are those candy canes <laughs> and it's 45 1 through 8 so this is a Christmas kit it is Christmas themed um, so this is 50 1 through 8 with the cute little snowman this is a 40 1 through 7 with like a nice little winter scene this is 70, one through nine with Santa and the snowman. And then this is 65, one through nine with two little dogs on some chairs. So that is the finale for the advent calendar. I think it ended nicely. I think a Christmas kit is, is a nice um, finishing for that so so yeah these are all the challenges that you get with the advent all right let's let's do a little a little sp spread here So those are all of the, the challenges you get and, and all the minis. Oh, forgot that guy. And all of the minis. And don't forget the micros on each bag. Okay, um, that is it. Thanks so much for watching everyone and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.